According to the deputy president, following the series of anti-government protests that had rocked the country, Mr. Odinga privately met with President William Ruto in Mombasa where he agreed to call for a truce but on condition that his personal demands are met. Gashago claims in the meeting, Odinga made personal requests that include a handshake that would see him get into a coalition government with President Ruto. The DP added that Mr. Odinga also asked for three ambassadorial positions, demands that were all declined. According to Gashagwa, Mr. Odinga was only offered a send-off package on condition he retires politically. The DP says in the agenda of the meeting with Ruto, the opposition leader sidelined his Azimio coalition co-principal Waipa leader Kalonzo Musyoka only to later have him to be the Azimio coalition delegation leader at the bipartisan talks. Ashagua, who was speaking at Kalonzo's political stronghold of Ukambani, thus claims that Kalonzo is once again being used unlike after the 2018 handshake, he will be in the cold with nothing to benefit his political backyard. This is MQBA News.